Hello, my mommyans. It's your girl, Davida Catherine, coming back to you with another video. Today, I am going to be recreating this beautiful pot that I've seen in Big Lots, but this pot was $30. And I'll insert a photo now. Okay, beautiful pot. As you guys know, I am doing a farmhouse theme um, to my apartment, so I said I would bring you guys along with me so let me show you guys what you need you need a bucket of your choice i chose this one because it was the closest to that um pot it's not glass but i don't really care about that and for a buck you can't beat it uh you're also going to need greenery which i found these at dollar tree for a dollar and i bought three of them you're going to need some type of filler because the one that I loved had rocks, I bought rocks. And I got three bags, but I'm not gonna use all three bags in this one thing. I'm actually going to use it for this, which this is a, a mason jar, and then these are flowers from Michael's when they had their 50% off sale. So I'm just gonna be filling the rocks up with this. But let's get to this DIY. So you're also gonna need a hot glue gun some scissors as well as hot glue sticks okay so the it, this is like so easy like really easy so i'm gonna move this out the way right now so what i'm going to do first and it may be a little hard is i'm going to try and break and bend this wire off because i want this piece to be as flat as possible if you have wire cutters, just use your wire cutters. Ugh, ugh. Okay, I'll be back. I gotta get my husband to cut them off. Okay guys, so they are extremely hard to come off. So, new trick. What I did was I just bent it just to get the stem out the way. And I'm gonna put a massive amount of hot glue and just glue them straight to the center. You want to hold it there for a little while just for the glue to set. Mom, I just want to help you with the rock. Okay, so while it's setting, I'm just going to be putting glue right in the middle and it should stand. No. Okay, hold on. Okay, guys, so. Had a little bit of difficulties. The hot glue is like taking forever to set. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my first bag of rocks and pour it in there just to help give it some standing power. There we go. That looks good already. So this is what it should be looking like. And then I'm gonna take my second bag. I wonder if I am gonna have to use all three. Because I, I didn't realize how deep this was. I'm going to take my second bag. Pour it right in there. Boosh it around. And it helps you be able to maneuver it. And that is really it for this pot. Like, that's it. And this, this is perfect. Okay, guys, so I love this. You, you, you can't beat it. It cost me $6 to make rather than paying 30 full price for it. And I, I'm, I'm just in love with this. So I'm going to go set it up, and then I'm going to show you guys how it looks. Okay, guys, so this is where I have it set up. I think that this is so pretty. It looks so good on top of it, and it brings you know, a little bit of fresh greenery to the house and I don't have to worry about watering anything. Now, if you want it fuller, obviously add more onion grass. Um, if you want it thinner, add less. But I think for $6, this is just amazing. If you have not yet liked any of my videos, please do so. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please subscribe, hit that button. 
hit that button. Oh, and how do you guys like my Scrabble wall? I think it came out super cute. It's not finished. I still have to add more photos and things like that. But I think it's super cute. All right, guys. Bye.